Hey, so I'm just gonna get right into it. Today I'm gonna be painting and the first thing I have to do is to cover the house in like gesso, 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 gesso. Yeah, and I picked out a few colors that I already have. I probably should have went to like, you know, check and buy the paint that I probably needed, but I think this color will make the color that I need. So I'm gonna try to mix this. I also have this little um, wet palette that I use for my miniatures. I don't think this is big enough, but I'm gonna try to use it anyway and hopefully it will work out well. And I took out my biggest brush, which is really not that big, but like this is the biggest brush I have. So I hope that you know, it wouldn't give me a lot of problem and it should work fine. And this little water slash um, brush holder is actually a gift from a friend. Thank you Charlotte from All Glorious Clay for gifting this to me. If you're interested, you can uh, let her know that you might want. This is actually made from ceramic. I've always wanted to learn ceramic and now that I have something that is made by a friend, it's pretty interesting. And yeah, she actually made three holes for me to put the brushes. I don't think this time round I will use more than one brush. But I really like, you know, having a lot more brush holders. I, I wouldn't even really mind if the whole thing has a slot for brushes. It's just really convenient to have lah. So thank you again so much. I'm going to use this today and I'm really excited to use it. I'm going to quickly try to paint all this and get on to the next step. I feel like the process has been really slow and I don't know, I hope that you're not bored but um, this is really the whole process and I'm really going to try to speed things up a little. I'm going to try to work a little bit longer even if there's no sunlight, I'm just going to work in my closet whenever I can. It's just that I can't really do it for like this thing lah. So I really need a sun for this but uh, for other things like cutting or whatever, if I can work until a little bit later and try to get more things done, the whole thing will be a bit faster too. So you will have to like see the same old thing again and again and yeah so i really hope that you stick around for a little bit longer hopefully the more interesting parts are going to come up soon i'm also starting work as early as i can it's actually 12.04 now and um, i've just been busy prepping meals for myself because i'm trying to eat healthier so i'm doing a lot of cooking at home and it's pretty tiring and also time consuming to cook at home I'm just trying my best to balance my health and also work. So it sucks that I have to start work so late but you know, I just have to try my best. This time round, I finally got a bit smarter and wore my like pants, my painting pants which I cannot wash off anymore. So <laughs> yeah, and let's go! Hey, so I just finished painting the exterior walls and this is how it looks like right now. The colour took me a while to mix but I think this is what the colour is supposed to look like. I actually used this thing that is supposed to be for measuring air dry clay to try to measure the paint but it was a bit failed because I forgot how many each thing I actually used and like it was a little bit inaccurate because it's paint right, it's a bit hard to control. I had to mix the colours like once or twice and then I decided that you know just getting a bigger container to kind of store the paint would make it a bit better and now I have some extra left which means that if I need to use it again I can use the same one. I also use a cling wrap to kind of cover it so that it doesn't dry up. Hopefully this will work. The next thing I'm going to do is to make plasters with crystal boards. I probably will do this at my craft closet so I don't really need to rely on the sun. Oh, it's gonna be a lot more exciting now. So I'm just gonna get right to it. I'll see you in a bit.